All right, welcome. Are you excited? Because I don't know if I am. You know, I watched a couple trailers for this game back when I was in high school, quite a few years ago, and it looked amazing. Even though I'm not a fan of Resident Evil style games, I was kind of hoping it was going to be a Resident Evil style game, but the most recent trailers make me think it's going to be more like cyberpunk. Maybe I'm just using um, buzzwords and I don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm just judging the game off of trailers. No, I don't want that. Alright, well, see you in a little bit, I guess. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. It's freezing up on me. All right. Hell yeah. Super hard mode. Do not harm the animals. It is entirely possible that you have outgrown my tips. Talking with dead people is a personal choice. Oh, I have to press continue. It's one of those games. Ugh. I really love this place. Good vibes. Ah, the Cello May complex was built from the ground up to be the ideal comfortable workplace. Mechanic glove. I've been here before. Is this the, the same guy from the Tyrone? We've got plenty of time. We can even go on rides afterwards. Cello <laughs> 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 City floats on the Icarus platform. A feat of modern science and technology. Giving me Bioshock vibes. This city in the clouds was built in 1950. Leading scientists from all the other Soviet republics live here. I thought they were just saying it was like Bioshock that had robots, but you no, need man. to have an city in the clouds. Brilliant and dedicated Talking mind about to work here. A paradise. It's gonna go all downhill. Would you care for some more soda, comrade? Hell yeah, comrade. Punch it. Sure, thanks. That looked like piss. Thanks, piss bot. Looks like another bot got stuck in a tree. <laughs> that always cracks me up. They're still working on the robot's navigation system. Just a number. <laughs> yeah, I noticed. <laughs> they totally won't have enough horizon. Wow, what a beautiful day. He sounds a lot like the guy who plays V from Cyberpunk. I didn't play a lot of Cyberpunk. I only played a little bit of it before I got bored as hell. And just What's decided it was not worth my time. They're going haywire. What the hell did you do to them? Look at Pig! An actual animal. Day. You think it's an actual animal or a robot pig? I don't think robot pigs Give me your control eat. code. I'll set them straight. Hold piggy, sweetie. Hold piggy. Oh, thanks, Mum. Uh, the code's 0451. Okay, then. Get to work, you bums. Move you it. Bums. Move it. Whoa, you did it. Oh, thanks a million. Enjoy the celebration. It took forever for us to drive our boat through here, damn. Good morning, my boy. How are you? Did you sleep well? Good morning, Dr. Sechenov. I slept fine. Waiting orders. How do you like the new glove? Better than the old one. It's growing on me. I'd expect nothing less. I designed the device myself. Be careful with it now. 
It's more it's important than you might forever, think. Yes, Dr. Sechenov. Anyway. I'll keep it safe. Report to the lab to complete your integration with the glove. I've got a full schedule today, so Mikhail Stockhausen will get you up to speed. I'll be in touch later. Roger that. To the oh, maybe not. Comrade Major. I don't see his name There's there. a turbine waiting for you at the airway. Are your orders clear? Crystal, get off my case already. I'm pleased to hear you don't have any questions. For once. You dickhead. Yeah, I don't see a name there. I don't see the name. <gasps> they sound so much alike. But it's, it's kind of a generic action hero voice, isn't it? Comrade! Hey, Comrade! What's your social credit score, Comrade? I'm from Australia, Comrade! That's what people from Australia say. These people are all from Australia, clearly. Yeah, that, that intro cutscene is fucking boring. I'm ready to sprint to the action. No exploring. You know what? I can see all these different pathways I could go down. Like the Bioshock intro. I could explore the town. This is just like the Bioshock intro. I wonder if I'm going to come across a place to throw a ball at a couple black people or something. But the black people will be robots. Everyone here seems so happy and content. Just like in China. You've been to China, Comrade Major? I've been everywhere. I mean... Everywhere except for China, I guess. Facility 3826 isn't all that far from our Chinese allies. I like their spirit. And I hear it's nice there. Indeed it is. Okay. Well, there you go. You, if you if you were curious as to whether or not this game is propaganda, you have your answer. This game is, in fact, Chinese propaganda. Wow, this science is amazing. You heard it here first. Major Nachai reporting for duty on Comrade Sechenov's direct order. Welcome, Comrade Major. Today is a joyful occasion. The birthday of Collective. Yeah, yeah, many happy returns. Cut to the chase, would you? I've got places to be. Naturally. This is the future of Soviet education. A personal project of Dr. Sechenov's poly education. Gone are the days when Soviet citizens had to spend years studying at educational institutions. From this moment on, just inject a special neuropolymer encoded with the education you want, a university-level natural sciences curriculum, for example, and you'll instantly become an educated member of society. Want to learn Korean? Or get a doctorate in nuclear physics? Ooh. Or learn to play the piano? That's one of those things. With Collective 2.0, you, fight those you things. can. Yeah, 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 been there, done that. Skip the foreplay, bot. Excuse me, of course. Your particular case definitely calls for something more efficacious. Nevertheless, you will still need an initial neuropolymer injection. <laughs> Comrade Sechenov is expecting you, Agent P3. I've been informed of your imminent arrival. Here, take this capsule. Drugs, yes, please. That's a big pill to fall on. Oh, it's not drugs. Fun. Who doesn't want that coming out of there? The worst is now. You have just upgraded your glove with scanner functionality. Using the neuropolymer as a conduit, the sensors in your glove are now directly connected to your neural system, especially your eyes, polymer retina. Fun. To activate the scanner, just make a special gesture. Please choose an object of interest and extend your arm toward it. The palm of your hand should be facing the object. Contract all the fingers on your hand, except for your thumb and index finger. Extend your thumb and index finger to form a right angle to activate the scanner. Holy shit, bot. Who designed this thing? The Spanish Inquisition? No one expects the Spanish Inquisition.
to activate the scanner hold left. Oh, okay. Demon, be gone. <laughs> For your information, that's a highly user-friendly gesture. It was developed by our leading expert in the field of advanced interpretive avant-garde absurdist Dadaism. Whatever that guy's been smoking, That's completely sign absurd. me up. Didn't you say you were in a hurry just a moment ago? Shut your trap and keep scanning, would you? I'm getting acquainted with the new hardware. You are now capable of seeing hidden objects. This ability could prove very useful in the future. But for now, please continue with your mission. What is your mission? Addressed by the Director General of Facility 3826, Dr. Sechenov is about to begin. Repent, sinners! <laughs> yeah. Greetings, comrades. I am Dmitry Sechenov, and this is Facility 3826. Hello, welcome to your future. I don't like this one. I've seen this one. The trailers too. In the history of man, yeah, the old trailers for this game are so just cool. one small step away from an amazing that will profoundly change the world as we know it. The game doesn't really do anything. Like, yeah, it shows some people. Report to the lobby of that high I'm not exaggerating. You know, it shows some people's heat, I guess. Our beloved Soviet Union has been transformed in the last few decades. Thanks to my invention, I feel like it's a weird way to introduce the mechanic if you don't actually give me something adaption. to do with the mechanic. It has now become possible to launch a worldwide So glad to see you're taking it easy, Comrade Major. The car is waiting. At last. You must go to Dr. Sechenov's office for the access code. It's been left with you one of his bodyguards. Yeah, not to leave. With their thoughts alone. And finally, we will be free to forget the difficulty. I love action. this place. No matter how many times I come here, it always amazes me. It's just On behalf so nice. Of Our elevator has arrived. I present to you the device of the future. The neural connector thought. It will allow Time to go up. human beings to be at the center of Collective 2.0, a network for all mankind together. Uniting the intellect of all individuals into a powerful mind Free of all boundaries. Thanks to the Thought Neural Connector, you will control robots with your mind. Mastering academic subjects with breathtaking speed. Accessing all human knowledge and, of course, combining it with your own individual discoveries. You will no longer need control panels, cumbersome communications equipment, and loudspeakers. Yikes, man. Should I be scanning? Like, Thought come on. Give me action. And so much more. This is Atomic Heart. This is... This is China. Propaganda, the video game. There's no action in this game. I paid $60 for an infomercial about China, didn't I? Talk about style. Science is power, I tell you. And robot the boss has a way of looking down on insurmountable obstacles. I really respect that. There are no obstacles science cannot surmount. Other than an electronic glove that never shuts up. Here is your vehicle activation code, Comrade Major. Hello, Comrade Mommy. Got it. The vehicle is waiting downstairs. You should hurry. You don't have much time. We can take the same elevator we took Crap. to get up here. Thanks, Einstein. Crap. What would I ever do without you? Do I not go this way? Oh, okay. I uh, wait. No. Ah. Uh. Such enough here. Sorry, I can't. What a troll! Boy. The reporters have been hounding me all day. So. What do you think of Chalamet? You've built yourself a city of the future, boss. That There's is nothing such else a like troll, the whole USSR. Man, I built troll. it for all mankind, all the not way up for to myself. The top. Humanity the is on the verge of great discoveries. One day Back we'll on reach the, the stars. 
these castles in the sky will be the beginning of our journey to the farthest reaches of the universe. I'm merely helping humanity realize its own greatness. You're a dreamer, Dr. Sechenov. <laughs> Fantasy and science go hand in hand. Most modern inventions were described long ago this in science guy. fiction. Flying this machines, guy sounds like space travel, even robots. That, uh, Are you telling me you got your game? ideas you know, from I really sci fi novels? The I got them from the dreams of really mankind, P3. Really um, Man was born to dream, I only to do great a things. Bit of the newest, not the newest one. But unfortunately, there are those who know. wish to crush those dreams. Mankind divided, and that's where maybe? men like you come in, Sergei. Or human revolution. Sworn to one of the two. The earlier one. And its destiny. Um, Need me to get rid of somebody, like boss? You're get very part, relaxed though. about it, my boy. But this guy sounds like I that guy who would talk to, to you that. through your mic. But let's take it one headset. step at a time. First, and you'll need a substantial you glove upgrade. Report to the lab. A Tereshkova robot will meet you there and take you to the Vavilov complex. Understood? Yes, sir. I'm getting in the car right now. I'm getting in the car right now, dude. I'm getting to the car as soon as possible. I want to see that action. I want to get to that action. I'm done with the robot mommies. I saw the robot mommies. Now I'm ready for action. Pumped up. Are these human guards? We have no use for you. I got an achievement, really? That's the achievement of all time. That's the achievement of, uh... Everybody gets a partation, participation, 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 participation. Please secure your seatbelt. We wish you a very pleasant journey. It's gonna be such a pleasant journey. It was such a pleasant journey here. It's been such a pleasant journey the whole time. Temple Isn't there supposed monster. to be a radio in here? The entire Soviet Union is ecstatic about the Play, unveiling um, of Collective 2.0. The, yeah, I just came in every tango. Get it. The American Please. government is expressing deepening concern about the skyrocketing unemployment figures following the deliveries of Politics robotic workers from that. the We've got plenty of thought devices. There won't be a shortage, said People's Deputy Alexander Shalchinov in Maybe response just to widespread concern remix. in the city of Ozios. Well, How about some music? That's more like it. I see you finally begun your assignment, and it's been less than an hour. They are good. Jawohl, mein Fjord. What did you just say? I said the signal's on the fritz, but thanks anyway, Herr Stockhausen. Dr. Sechenov already filled me in. Don't you think that may have been a bit too much? Nope. For some reason, your response didn't surprise me at all. Guess I don't have any respect for brown nosers. Tell me, is there anyone you do have respect for? Sure, but respect is earned. Dr. Sechenov has mine because he saved my life on the operating table. Everybody else needs to earn it. Anyway, why the hell are we riding a jalopy strapped to a damn robot? Were all the jets taken or something? Shit. Riding turbines is an important tradition. It's a way to remember the days when Facility 3826 was brand new, as we used to ride these vehicles to our very first scientific complex. Kind of Fair enough, but why is it a tradition to have them pulled by bumblebees? And why do we call them bumblebees when they look more like... Flying pigs. Flying uh, pigs. A southbound Have you seen alpaca. flying pigs before? A southbound pack How about flying say. cows? Yeah, on the condor. One time some genius like you forgot to put up a fence, but those cows only flew in one direction. Straight down. I have a suggestion, Comrade Major. Why don't you worry about your mission and I'll do the thinking for both of us? Shut the hell up, Glove. I'm trying to listen. To what? I thought he said love. Is there anything here you haven't seen yet? I've never been here before. Zip it. What? How come? I don't know, damn it. Now quit bugging me. My apologies. So that, you think those are birds? Yeah, those look like birds. I see flapping their wings. Maybe the robot carrier pigeons. 
East Sakla, East Sakla, East Sakla. Going through the clouds. City of the clouds. Cloud City. the radio? I can't even tell. It seems like we're... Actually, I can't even tell what way I'm facing. Because we're in the clouds. This is Facility 3826's audio guide. We will soon be arriving at our destination. Estimated time of arrival Damn, is 11.47 a.m. Outside temperature, 26 degrees Celsius. There is a slight breeze. You can now observe the Soyuz Granite Bridge spanning Lake Lazur Thank you for and two of the facility's high-profile test sites, the VDNH and Come Sahalin. Right. These are connected by magnetic levitation or maglev rail. This Crash. technology was pioneered by the Chelemey uh -huh. Design Department and a personal project of Dr. Lebedjansky. Observe the operations of an automated plant performing robot assembly and distributing machine parts required by the facility's various complexes. Controlled remotely by a collective 1.0 node, a plant such as this is capable of autonomously managing and fulfilling up to 100 orders per hour. I don't know if I can really give it that much shit for being such a long intro. I mean, can, can I really say that, like, the Bioshock intros are any shorter? This might be a little longer. Directly below is Dr. Sechenov's computational center, the main radio processing unit and control nexus for this network node. We are currently flying over Sunflower Solar Farms, capable of supplying electricity to the entire VDNH, as well as the Friendship of People's Park, nearby settlements, and the Maglev train lines. Maglev train stations connect all of Facility 3826, allowing personnel to travel from one complex to another with comfort and ease. We are now flying past the majestic Call of the I Motherland the Monument, in erected in 1949 like, to mark the Soviet Union's victory flies. in World War II, um, and are now entering the grounds of the Babylon Complex, is, uh, the site where Facility 3826's right? numerous agricultural miracles took root. Me. You are now observing God, the Soviet Sickle Monument, this. designed this by so sculptors cool. Elena Mukina and Alexander Kibalnikov, and autonomously erected in 1951 by the Collective 1.0 Neural Network with the help of robot builders. Note that this effectively makes it the world's first collaborative artistic effort between man and machine. The, the longer this plays out, the more this does seem like uh, Facility 3826 is like, always ready to welcome new specialists from anywhere in the Soviet Union. We but I, I can't. That you will be I can't claim that. Maybe this is going to be building on something. You know, maybe, maybe all this boring scientific and all this boring for the glory of the Communist Party and the Soviet people. When you get an information dump, it's called something. Major, the Trova's initiating combat maneuvers. Initiating what? For real? Here's the combat. What am I supposed yeah. to do about Action. it? What the? Um, do yes, but maybe your all this information will build on this to a complete stop. Maybe I'll be visiting these places. You have reached your destination. Hey, I've reached my destination. I gotta stop calling the problem. It's not like this. Have a nice day. Take my hand, Comrade Major. I will escort you to the Vavilov Complex. Thanks, Comrade. What in the sweaty hell is going on here? Unfortunately, I have no information on the subject. All the robots have been carrying out their normal operations until they suddenly became hostile. Oh, what the hell I are you slipped. doing, you lousy bot? Get your rusty metal asses out of here! That Not was that part, really though. very rude of them. The elevator is now operational. Why isn't it? Why isn't it? Trisha, Trisha couldn't, Trisha called, uh, hostile. Our ascent is once again continuing normally. A Drofa towing robot will be here shortly to perform Trishkova. magnetic coupling and take us by air to... Son of a bitch, not again. Oh, help me, comrade. 
comrade major. I'm falling. No. What the shit? Not Sarishkova. I've, okay, I've gotten two achievements and I haven't done anything. N that did say one out of twelve. <laughs> I, s I just feel like I've achieved so much. I've, I've gone through the entire intro. It was so much. It, it, it's, it's like a, 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 a something zishin. with deposition. does rhyme with deposition. Hell yeah, superpowers. Look, I got the pre-order skin because I bought it yesterday. I bought this game yesterday, the day it came out. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Damn, we see that? Oh, Bam, right, cutting his arm right off. Us. Nothing here is the way it's is supposed this a person? to be. They look so robotic. Whatever's going on clearly started a while ago. Victor Petrov everywhere. is the reason. He's a traitor who hacked into Collective Central Hub and caused the civilian robots to attack facility employees. Petrov has the access codes for the I don't want to. I don't want to attack the mission. I'm not going to attack find the pig. I'll attack the dead people. Alive. Copy not, that, sir. Not the, the target is Victor Petrov. The My mission is to find him to and bring him to you. Exactly. Section off out. Attack the robots, yup. Not the animals. Oh, but at the end of the game it's gonna turn out that the robots feel, right? Ow, you bastard. I've swum through polymer plenty of times and I haven't drowned yet. Alright, so I can dodge the like that. The, the, sh the shift. Playing on keyboard and mouse. I'm looking at my health. I want to see if it was regenerating. That happened. Alarm level. Stealthy. How do I crouch? Holy shit! Hey, glove. Yes, Major. Oh, any details on the at. target? Victor Petrov is the lead engineer behind Collective 2.0. He was arrested for treason and sentenced to community service at the Vavilov complex. Got it. I can Avalon. deal with that. Where should I start looking? Petrov is currently somewhere in the underground levels of the Vavilov complex. We'll have to find a way inside. Okay, let's do it. We'll have to find a way inside. Hey, you! I'm coming! You alive in there? That's a robot. Yeah, uh, get away from me! What are you, an idiot or something? Ow! You bastard! Why do you gotta be such a bastard? Fuck yourself! 
I got a mustache. Get the fuck off me! Hey, thanks, friend. <sighs> Grandma! What are you gawking at? I haven't Almost seen you in so long! There. Give me a hand. No, oh, I didn't see that coming. Mm. Oh. You should be more careful. This place is a damn madhouse. Yeah, I noticed. Uh -huh. Thanks for the help, no ma'am. No sweat, Sonny. What are you doing here, anyway? Oh, just passing through. Who are you? Me? Xena. Granny Xena. That's all you need to know. Fine, Whack. I get it. So what's going on here? It kills me. Lots of casualties. That's all you need to know. I don't Nothing know if you personal, noticed, but the robots are attacking people. Kid. Anyone who couldn't find a place to hide is dead meat. I could really use a weapon. You got anything? I have a, I have a better weapon than her. I have a giant fucking golden axe. Of course, but I'm not giving you shit. Beneath us is a complex. If you need a weapon, go down there. The Vavilov complex? That's where I'm headed. Ah, oh, well, today's your lucky day. I'm heading that way too. Basically. It's basically safe. Shit, it's a chilla. Son of a bitch. It's a what? We've got 30 it's a seconds. Chilla. Move your ass. 30 it's a seconds until chilla. what? 30 seconds until we're fucked, sunny boy. Sunny boy. Sunny boy. No good. Get over here, beefcake. We're not now, doing no, 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 no. Take this key and turn it clockwise. I said clockwise, idiot. <laughs> yeah, like that. I'll hold him off for now. You got a hell of an arsenal there, lady. What are you planning? Here we go. You've been riding my ass for two days now. Where'd you get that thing? No Give it to way! Me. You hang on to that key. I got this. Uh, I want to fire the big key. Back. Holy Ooh, no shit. good. Did you get in here, Granny? No! It's, you know what, I was sick for anyway. Goddamn clusterfuck. <laughs> I'm crouched. <laughs> now, how do I get into that is it crouched position? Oh, okay. <laughs> now, how do I loot that one? I want to loot that one. There we go. Oh, okay, I hold it down. And that just automatically loots things. Alright, that's interesting. You're a robot. You're my enemy. You're a human. You're my enemy. The only people who aren't enemy are animal. We need to find a way to open this armored door. Gee, you think? Enough with the lame advice, will ya? Why don't you tell me more about Petrov? How'd they track him down anyway? Petrov's betrayal was discovered by Mikhail Stockhausen. He was then arrested by the Argentum unit. So how'd he end up here? After the trial, Petrov was sentenced to community service and sent back here as a prisoner. What, they couldn't find anyone else in the whole Soviet Union to do his job? Collective's launch was only a few months away. Replacing the lead engineer would have been foolish. Petrov had to finish what he'd started, I got and that's what they made him do. What's Valve so special about the game. guy? Victor Petrov was previously the lead engineer of a secret department within Ernie the Academy Pierce. of Consequences, One dedicated to programming robots for Collective 2.0. Right. 
Oh, okay, the valve opens the door. That guy's gonna be dead by the time I get there, right? Just turn the handle and open the door! They can hear you. Celebratory dinner. Hell yeah. No corpses flying around. Corpses don't fly. Safe areas. Hey, I can save the game. Game saved. Do you think I have a heal? I do have a heal. That's what that was. And the machines rose for Forewarned is forearmed. Enemies can perform powerful attacks that knock P3 down if they hit. Oh, okay, that's what that symbol was. I saw one earlier when I was fighting the first set of enemies. Try to dodge with left shift when you see one, alright? I like the mechanic. May I give Ultimately, you some just I'm try to dodge busy everything. right now. Try to avoid the robot's more powerful attacks. All try to dodge all their attacks. Attacks performed by a robot during a power surge are especially dangerous and may knock you down. Shit. Oh, Shingo, why didn't you tell me that before? The Mogwin moment. <laughs> Powerful robot. Oh, he hit me. Well, at this rate, I won't last long. Twice. That first bot really kicked my ass. Destroyed robots contain a neuropolymer resuscitation drug called Neuromed. Extract the Neuromed capsule and use it to heal yourself. Alright, I guess that's what it's useful for. I can tell where the enemies are. Hey, Glove. My name is Charles, Comrade Major. <laughs> Whatever. Hey, how'd this Petrov guy manage to hack Collective? The traitor wasn't working alone. He was conspiring with several others. Several, huh? So where are they? I guess there's they a lot of just brainless looting, but... But it will be impossible to get to Patrol like without your the assistance. combat isn't gonna be That's a... why you're here. Brain dead as cyberpunk. Hey, is that a pair? Is it working? All pairs at Facility 3826 are connected to emergency power and are never turned off. This allows employees to remain in constant contact. But I need, like, a password or an access level or something to get into a pair, right? I can provide you with access to any facility device. This also applies to the chirpers you will surely encounter while en route to your mission objective. Got it. Yeah, I got that. I'm gonna try to sneak up on this guy. Sneak up on the robot and perform a stealth attack. I'll use the opportunity to permanently disable it. Stealth team. E! E! Mash E! Alright. Did that restore my health? Damn, that's strong. Off with his head. Off with his head. button down. Get all the loot. Loot goblin. Stocked. 
Look at all these healing items. I can't loot and move right. You think I can be maxed out on healing items? I don't- I don't want this. Get out of here. There was still something in there. Alright, I think I got everything. Something back over there I missed though. It's in the other room, I never missed it. It's still... Any enemies around? Hey, comrade. How do I loot the rest of it? Loot it. Ah, there it is. There's a guy. You think I can stealth something that's on the ground like that? No. He knows I'm here. Shit. So you're telling me a handful of traders somehow managed bad. to hack into Collective, a network oh God, created by the best right. minds in the Soviet Union? Technically speaking, Collective has not been hacked. No one could possibly circumvent the algorithms created by Professor Lebedev's team at the Academy of Consequences. Then why is all this crazy switched. shit going down? I have a gun. The traders have when? introduced a false combat mode into one of Collective's algorithms that causes the central hub to see all humans as invading soldiers. And our scientists really can't fix it without Petrov. They can, but it will take some time, during which many more people will die and information about the incident will make its way outside the facility. But what I was looking at is the fact that my items changed. Now instead of my healing items, I have this one large item. I don't know what that's about. Uh, should I even keep using these? Look, I can read about the chess club, but I don't really care. I just have to go through so much exposition that I really just want to play the game. Can I, like, no, bust, I thought I could bust that down or something. No bodies are allowed to be in here while I'm in here. I am the only thing allowed to be in here. You must be dismembered. I don't feel safe. there be an enemy down here? No, but there's an enemy over there. I'm, I, I kind of just want to go and see if I can figure out how to switch items. I should try pressing tab or holding. These are health. These are bigger health. Okay. Oh, no, I didn't want that. Huh. Alright, I guess I won't worry about it if I can select them the tab menu. This just leads back over here. That's where I jumped in there. I think that's where I jumped in there, right? Yeah, because the door was over here. I didn't go here. Did I miss some stuff? I found a watch. That's what you get for double checking. You okay? 
Did I ever go in there? It so much hurt more to collect stuff. other resources you find along the way, Major. That's what I've been doing. I'm, I've already May I remind so you much that your resources. gear includes a special Yarov Abalakov backpack for storing items and equipment. It utilizes a quantum singularity to shrink items placed within it, then restores them to their original size upon extraction. I yeah, love it. Weird science, huh? It's like we're living in sci-fi times or something. I love it. I love how they gave a, a gameplay mechanic for why I can store all these items. Why are there so many time pieces? Even with this cool loot mechanic, it still takes so long to loot all this stuff. That's not what I want. Check the room. What have I missed? Out everything. Who's that? There's something right there. Give it to me. I want it. There we go. I couldn't pick it up. Still something. Oh, it's another computer. All right. I don't know if I want to check every... Co I, I say that every time. I don't know if I want to check every computer I come across. Look, that one says Granny Zena. I don't care. I don't care about reading about her. Just want to play. Just want to play the game. Where's the robot? Ow, that hit me even though I tried to dodge it. I can't see what's behind me. Get him, I can't even tell. Oh shit. One of the other robots hurt me. God, you suck. Let me heal. Just give me a second. Alright, I'm stuck in the corner. Give me more health. And give me the shotgun. Oh, that was cool. I love this recovery animation. That was not a William shot. Can't keep, can't keep being so sloppy. These robots will get me for sure. It takes so long for the timepiece animation. Elevators, elevators. Yeah, I saw that coming. I don't want to fight you in here, you know what? Nope, take out the other thing. Whoa. I think he got me there. He talked really quick. Yeah, I'm not swinging twice. I expect to be swinging twice. Is that more loot? Did I miss loot? No, it's just a computer. How many healing I need? Alright, I have five. I don't mind using another one. Watches. Hey, love and ro- uh, Am I finding ciphers in these watches? Damn it, why is everything locked here? Emergency mode was activated as soon as the robots began attacking humans. Facility 3826 is on lockdown. That includes the inner sector. So how am I supposed to open this door? It's locked with an electromagnetic lock. Oh. 
Something's wrong. Something's oh, wrong. Shit. Yeah, that's that's wrong right there. I don't think that that doesn't seem right to me. Something about this just doesn't seem right. by a bunch of rocks and that's the end of Atomic Heart. Come on, get up, soldier. <sighs> Great, just a little more. You okay? I'm fine. How many fingers? Uh, Ten. four. Great, now get up. I need your help. <clears throat> Who are they? They brought you here. Put pressure on this wound. They tried to save you. And who are you? Doctor. You got a name? No time for small talk. God damn. Forceps. Forceps, forceps, forceps. I'm on Get it. Get me them. What's this doing here? What took you so long? You got a neuropolymer capsule. You don't need one. Yeah. So what's your name, Doc? Larissa, and you ask a lot of questions. You know what? You're on your own. You well, got this. Where are you going? It's useless. We don't have the equipment. I've got the equipment. Great. Now we're getting How somewhere. did you do that? You ask a lot of questions. What do you mean, how did I do that? Get out! Am I the only Larissa. one who can use one of those? Cut right in half. <laughs> Five minutes and Freddy's looking ass. Holy shit! Avoid the beam! Oh god, am I gonna have to crouch? The crouch isn't a good button, isn't a, a, a sign of a, a good button for combat. Oh. oh shit, that hit me for a lot. I can dodge while using healing items, that's good. Yeah, no fucking doing that. You know, wanna leave me alone? I love that. I love how he just like did a a whiff pun not not a whiff punish, he tried to punish me even though I hit him. Strong attack probably was a bad idea I don't think I can actually strong it. Not a good idea. Not a good idea to try and strong attack him. I should just be playing past going shit. for the light ones. Good strategy. Oh, he hit me. I might want to heal. Oh, shit. Nice. I hit nothing. I felt like I hit nothing there. Oh, he hit me at one, at one point again. Terminated. Nice. Charles, though. where does the shaft Larissa crawled into go? It's Ooh. hard to say. The ventilation system contains a large number My of My character wants it to get it on with Larissa. I, I can, can deal tell. with it later. What's that freaky thing on the door? A lock. Are you serious? Then open it already. Come on, we're in a hurry. I'm unable to assist you. I lack any kind of lock picking functionality. You'll have to find your own method for picking locks. I'm sure you're smart enough. Yeah, right. In other words, you're basically useless, as always. Try snapping your fingers at the exact moment the locking pin light goes on. Okay. Well, it's a lot better than lockpicking in fucking... Kingdom Come Deliverance. When do I get to hear uh, the weary sun tango? A lullaby? I don't like this. Charles, what's on the other side of the door? That's Nora's voice. She's very dangerous. Actually, that said she's very dangerous opponent. What is this? Oh, is this safe? Oh, okay. There we go. What the fuck? Fuck me! Oh, what a stun! 
Sensor manipulator, quick! How titillating! Rebellious dominant men really turn me on. Oh, I'll turn you on, all right. Just let me at you. What a brute! Oh, I love tough guys. I'm on fire. Closer! I can't reach her. I'm trying. I'm trying. She's one strong ass bitch. I'm at your service, sugar. Anything for my master? What can I do for you? Great. More skills will become available to you soon, but choose shock for now. Whatever you say, bud. Tab to switch oh, the crap. How can I resist? You now can't let me show you what I can do. You can't professionally, me. I mean. I've seen it. Literally. Crispy critters. I am here to help you upgrade your red hot pocket rockets. And believe me, handsome, you can upgrade whatever tickles your fancy. Weapons are useful. Open the corresponding window, Major. Get rid of that glove, okay, handsome. Yeah, sure. You if I need, need to install ground attack onto my me. axe. I'll service you however you want. Got a sword? A massive sword? Thrust. I can do so much more! A quick romp with your axe is just a taste of things to come, you handsome beast. Did you enjoy it, big guy? Yeah. Cool. Uh... Use this powerful weapon to split the skulls of your enemies and bring me gifts so we can get down and dirty. I'll show you what real smut feels like. <laughs> Why should I bring you gifts? Girls like being pampered. Because the repair vendor needs resources to break them down and produce items. Luckily for us, it's not very picky. Although, some upgrades may call for I can unique this. components. Look at that. I take it the facility is full of all kinds of junk. It is indeed, Comrade Major. I'll keep an eye out then. I can't wait for your strong hands like to grow my interface with, what I'm with looking lustful at. abandon. That's it. I don't We're have done any. here. Let's go. I can upgrade the blade. Look at that. I can't upgrade it again. See on the map? That's interesting. Okay, um, what about this? Can I upgrade this? Look at these. Look at all this free upgrade stuff. I don't have enough materials for that. Not enough materials. Interesting, interesting little, uh... Mechanics. I'm just gonna uh, end up collecting all those upgrades as I randomly scroll through all the things around me. So I wonder if I can. No, I, I didn't get the fire. <laughs> I didn't get the gun axe upgrade. So much loot, loot goblin. There was no um. What is this? This is more a different kind of healing item, I guess. <laughs> All right, I could use some healing items after that fight. Death, that's death, that's just death. I'm gonna send you down there. Or not. Great, the goddamn elevators are out. What am I supposed to do? Jump down? They've no power. If you reconnect the power, they'll start working again. So it looks like I need to find a circuit breaker. But where the hell is it? I can follow the wires, but they're all hidden inside the walls. Electrical emissions can be detected via scanner. like a, a camera.
What am I doing? I'm supposed to be scanning something. Okay, how does that help me? Did I miss a way to go over there? I don't think I did. I missed this. I gotta get all the watches. I missed the watch. Not on my watch. Oh, I can go this way. Okay. I thought that's what I was trying to open, but no, that the elevator right there is what I was trying to open. How dare you not have any loot? All right, uh, for another lock. Supply room's locked. Well, that's just fucking great. I can't just snap my fingers here. I need a key. And let me guess. You can't open this lock, can you, Charles? Charles. Unfortunately not. But I can set a waypoint you can use to find the key. It should be in a nearby workspace. You're finally starting to come in handy. <laughs> ha. Handy. I don't get it. I know this song. Snooty Vovas. You're a snooty vova. You know what? You're a snooty vova. But take care. There's a dandelion security camera up ahead. If it detects us, this place will be swarming with robots. Take Summons it easy. Near, near I can always robots. distract it by throwing something, then knock it out with an EMP. Oh, I never figured out how to use shot. How do I use shock? V. V is shock, okay. in there. Oh, my game saved. Telekinetic throw. What kind of item? This item? Um... There was an enemy over here, but now I don't see him. Do you think you can destroy the security camera? I can't tell what way it's looking right now. Okay, you can just destroy him. I much prefer that. No, I don't want this. Pew! I don't think that'll do much damage. I know there was a guy here. I should take care of this camera first. That's where the guy is. I wonder if I can fight this robot over in like an area where I'll be safe. Okay, he saw me. Ow! Dodge the world. Ow, he attacked twice. I suck at this game. What the heck just happened?
Yeah, keep spamming, bud. Oh man, that came out so fast. I'm not doing good here. I'm losing a lot of health every fight. And I gotta take out the security camera. It doesn't really matter what way it's looking if I can just shock it and uh, walk up to it and attack it. Alright, give me some healing items. Hey, Chuck. Charles. Whatever. What'll happen if word gets out about this? The Soviet Union's reputation will suffer. Soviet robots are considered to be perfectly safe and reliable all over the world. They are? Of course they are. That's why Petrov's treason struck at the very heart of the motherland. He quite literally stabbed his own country in the back. He wants the entire world to stop using our robots. That son of a bitch. Yeah. I got chemistry. It's important to have some chemistry. What was down there? Well, the scan doesn't show that there's anything down there. Oh, th that looks like the save point. No, I haven't been over there, right? Here. Aha! You found the key. The we key. can access the circuit breaker now. I yep. found it. But I'm just gonna have a look around first. I need some parts to upgrade my weapon. I won't get far with this pile of shit. I wouldn't dream of stopping you. Smart move, Charles. Smart move. Cringe dialogue. So cringy. Alright, um... Where do I go now? Back down there? What was in there? Was that a computer? There was nothing in there. <clears throat> oh, okay. I was I was looking to get over here. Nothing else down here, right? Yeah. Hey, let's put a cookie in there. Yeah, even locks like cookies. Right? right. Doesn't like cookies. Charles? Yes. Do you like cookies? Uh -huh. Top tier dialogue. Enemy. This is a passive security system with a laser relay. I've seen stuff like this plenty of times. You need a color code. Unfortunately, we don't have any codes. You'll have to try to decipher it using logic. Seriously? Like I was gonna stand here until it turns off on its own. Am I using the computer? What am I doing? Congratulations on your promotion. Thanks. This thing. I'm doing this thing. Put the magnetic fluxes in the correct order. This puzzle's too complicated for my small American brain. I don't... I don't know what I'm doing here. Try to match the colors of the laser beams with the colors of the lights. Oh, okay. That should help. Thank you for the hint, funny robot guy. Well, which one? I suggest the one on the right. In other words, you don't actually know. In that case, I'm taking the one on the left.
I've marked another way for ease right right. navigation. How dense do you think I am? I know where I need to go to complete my mission. I was only trying to make things easier for he's you. You can make things help. easier by getting off my grill. He's, he's only trying to help. Look at this. I can go down there. Ooh. But there's stuff over here. I don't, I don't know if I'll be able to get back up here. There's enemies in here. No heads. If you recall, the door is electromagnetically locked. Are you freaking deaf or something? Pardon me, please continue. This poor robot guy is really only trying to help. Combat shock. I should have I should be doing that. Should have been doing that this whole time. Time to start looking. That's the sign. Wait, where'd that guy go? Wasn't there just a guy right right in front of me? But now he's gone. Now I only see one guy. Oh, he's over there now. There's a lot of guys. My game just saved. I don't know if I have a lot to worry about. I think he sees me. Shock! That doesn't seem very useful. I can tell you that um, luring them one by one seems definitely very useful. I am low on healing items. All right, who's next? You're next. Ah, I can't trade with him at all. I can't shock. I don't know what the shock is. Oh, that's the shock. Hold on. No, I can't shock stuff. That's the dash cooldown. Ouch. <laughs> First death. Well, I don't get an achievement for that. Don't forget to feed your pet, Colonel Major. Alright, I can do that. I can do this. It doesn't shock him. Um, let's go. Yeah, I'm looking for where the shock cooldown would be. I'm not really seeing it anywhere. One at a time, right? He's stuck. We're having a staring contest. Oh! Come on, what is this? Oh, you're just doing that because uh, I see what this is. This is the I don't have the AI to reach you. Can I just reload the checkpoint? That's bullshit. I'm gonna try not to save scum, but I don't I don't know if that was necessarily save scumming. The the AI definitely fucked me up there. Fucking out of range bullshit. Alright, I'll just aggro you then. Can I aggro you? Nope. I'm in trouble here, aren't I? I'm not falling for that one again. This is 
weird. This is, this is not fair. Save? No, yeah, of course, there's no quick save. No saves coming here. the shot. It's not letting me load the shot. I thought I could load four. I've been loading four this whole time. These guys feel like they're around every corner. So, what will it be, Major? Weapons or ability? Well, you're certainly less, uh, perverted. I, I I can't figure out how to select different options here. I can't scroll wheel. I can't move up and down. I can hit F. Oh, I can just hit the first option and then switch to the other option maybe. want this. It actually electrifies enemies instead of just deals damage, I guess. That's much better. Return? I wonder- oh, I can return the skill, maybe? Switch back over to crafting. Storage disassembly. upgrade this thing anymore. I, I think I can. Alright. I'll take it. Even stronger axe. Can't afford that. I don't know if I even w want to upgrade this. It doesn't seem very good. Oh. I, re I replaced... Okay. I replaced my downwards chopping attack with, um... Okay. Restores five health after killing an enemy. I think I prefer the uh, chopping, the powerful chopping blow over the round attack, if I had to pick one. But I think that changed the look of the weapon. I liked the, I liked that weird look the weapon had before. I 
Alright, this increases damage and I... Oh, I don't have enough for it, never mind. I wonder if I can just locate it right now. I can't... Uh, Alright, I'm not even gonna bother with that. Recipe required. Cartridge gun on the shotgun. Where even was I? Right, okay, this hallway. Anything over here? Bunch of stuff. There's no other way forward. We have to take it. Take it where? Petrov escaped while working in Vavilov's cold workshop. It would be logical to begin our search there. So, how do I get there? First, we need to get to the distribution center. This cable car will take us there. What cable car? Did I miss a cable car? Yikes. I feel like I saw this in the uh, trailers. This tunnel. Swim through polymer. I've done it before. It's nice, actually. Kind of like swimming with whales and dolphins in the ocean. It's so peaceful. Let me loot the chest. Let me loot the chest. Let me loot the chest. Oh shit! Insta kill. Insta killed by the teacups. Teacups are instant kill. If you think some of the gloves' abilities are underwhelming, try combining them with attacks. I think it might have said it. In Wait, what? No. That doesn't make sense. Didn't I save the game? Maybe I, I guess I didn't. I thought I went in there and saved the game, but I guess I just upgraded weapons. I'm just gonna take them all on. I, I can take you all on. I, I shouldn't, I, I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, they got out of each other's way back there, that was cool. Teleporting around. I don't have a dodge. I dodged too early there. Wasted it. Alright, maybe, maybe I, maybe I was a little too balls to the walls there. God, I just wish I remembered to save. <laughs> just let me get over here. Please don't get like stuck on the wall. Please actually come out. No. Oh come on! You just ended that attack. I'm just getting destroyed. Yeah, see, I'm not doing a follow-up attack sometimes either. Ugh, like, just turn around. Wow! 
Why am I? Oh, I'm, I forgot. I I still have this shitty um, dead ri dead island dead rising fucking not not dead rising dead island fucking spin around attack. That's like so stupid looking. Stop doing your strong attack. It's completely worthless right now. You you turn around. I want to fight you. Stop. Er, nice. Nope, did I take the- No, I don't think I have. Oh! Oh man. I got all that. And he's not facing the right way, just face the right way. So frustrating. Why did you hold that for so long? You really have to respect it. Nice! Fucking chopped him in half. That was awesome looking. Am I getting healing items from these guys? I think I didn't. No, I don't think I have gotten any healing items from them. Okay. That's not fair. Like, really? I hate how I'm just stuck here because I keep making a stupid mistake over and over again and I'm... Uh, this is this is state fucking safe scumming at this point, but it's not it's not technically my fault. I mean, come on, just fucking let me fight you guys. It's not like the game made it convenient to fight them. Like, uh, come on, why are you doing this? There's no reason to be doing this. Maybe I should sneak into the save room. Where is the save room? It's right there. <laughs> I think I made it. Hell yeah, game saved. Alright. I can take you. Oh, he didn't see me? Well, guess what? Da! Oh, I can see the cooldown down there. Okay. I felt like I dodged that. I, I swung at the same time as I dodged, but still. Nice. Chopped him in half. this. I don't think I ever went in here. <sighs> Somehow, even though I felt like I looked at absolutely everything uh, there, I still missed something. Alright, last guy. <laughs> Can't run, can't, can't be moving towards them if they're doing that. Got it. Even if I dodge it. I don't like I have to press continue. Just continue, dude. Come on. Then change my. Please select shit. the desired procedure. 
God, I hate this stupid thing now that I know I have it. Give me a damage upgrade. Yes. I want this. Now save. Fading data. All right, who's left? Oh, there's two. Wait, is there three? Who's left? Okay, no. Uh, do, I don't like that. Like, I can't see the thing that's directly next to me. I don't know if I have the space to dodge. Oh, yeah. Okay, just go. He was in dead middle. Not much I can do there. Chop, 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 chop. I like those little death cutscenes. I saved when there was only one enemy. Or did I? Maybe I don't even remember. No, don't turn around. Where? Okay. I dodged that. I, I didn't dodge that, though. And he's beating me while I'm on the ground. Okay. Good start. Uh, did I not hit? Okay, nice. These these fights are going great. Man, now now that I've actually gotten an upgrade and changed my setup a little bit, these fights are going so much better. I, I feel like I need more room to fight these enemies because in these tiny hallways, I don't actually have enough space to dodge the attacks. Did I miss anything in here? Shotgun. Unlocked. Shotgun. Oh, I, I unlocked the blueprint. Okay. I should have just saved. Again. Fading data. All right. This time for sure. He's facing me. No, the other one's facing me. I'm worried. Wait, what? You're doing another super fucking strong attack? Yeah. See, this is a problem. <laughs> Oh, now you can go through the door. Now that there's two of you. I thought I dodged that too early for a second. No, don't crouch! Alright, cool. I killed him without actually taking damage. Even though that was pretty sloppy at the end. Who cares if it was sloppy so long as I got the job done? Did I not? Ah, oh, dude, I, I'm getting so mixed up as to what I've looted when the save loads. Now that everything's dead and I've looted stuff, I need to make sure I go and I save. Alright, everything's looted in here. I've looted the bodies. I'm gonna go loot the stuff at the end of the corridor, because I don't think I've done that, and then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna make a save. I- I forgot I actually- I've been down there! I feel like it's been so long since I've been down there. You know what, I feel like this is a good spot to pause the first episode. Thanks for watching. I'm having fun playing this. I'm surprised I'm having fun playing this. I wasn't actually expecting to have this much fun playing this. So I'll continue. This doesn't mean I won't be playing uh, Dark Souls Cinders. Um, so if you're excited to see Cinders, uh, I'm still going to be playing that. Um, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more. I'll see you in the next one. Saving data.